Hey, this is Tony with MusicGuyOnline.com. I got your three-minute mix fix video tip tutorial of the week. And recently we've been talking about how to make a chorus stand out, particularly in the case of a song where just through the composition or the recording of the song, the chorus doesn't really leap out of the speakers the way you want it to when it hits that transition. So we have different tricks we can use as the mixing engineer to really emphasize that chorus and use the mix in a way as a compositional tool to really drive home the most important part of the song. And that is to make the preceding and following parts sound different by comparison. It's how we make a dynamic mix. And today we're going to use a bit of EQ, um, reverse EQ in a way, because we're going to be taking it off during the chorus. So... Let me explain, right here in the verses, I have made, let me go to the master right here, I have made a cut right here on the EQ, and you can see this is around the 1K range. I've made a very broad cut. We're cutting out, kind of scooping out from about 200 hertz to, to about 4,000 kilohertz. We have this very uh, gradual, uh, gradual slow Q curve coming down, cutting it out about 2 dB. And the most extreme part right there is about the 1K range. So this is going to dull the verses, and then I'm going to remove that EQ cut by basically just uh, removing the uh, device itself from the mix once we hit that chorus. So you can hear the change in real time as the mix gets brighter. And we're not adding brightness to it uh, artificially. We're just putting back in what was already there. And it makes for a nice dynamic way to make a transition from, you know, sort of more of a kind of a subtle verse into a even larger chorus. So let's hear that difference. Here it is on. Let's remove the cut. with it and without it so things get a little bit brighter but you know we're not adding anything to the higher range you know we're not artificially like going in and uh, creating a boost or anything like that which would make it you know a little harsher on the ears we're just putting back in what was already there and it makes for a brighter stronger chorus and it's as simple as that just putting back in what we took away for the purposes of of the uh, the verse and it even gets a little bit louder there too because again all eq is is just making uh db cuts just particularly and specifically in certain ranges so when we put that in we're just putting you know basically 2 db back into the song in that particular range so the net result is everything gets a little bit louder all right Simple fix, but a great way to, again, drive home a chorus, make a chorus bigger than it is, and create that separation. All right, I am Tony with Music Guy Online. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe. We do these videos every week, and I hope to see you next week.